Hey guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome back to another episode from the Hermitcraft server. In today's episode, we are going to be doing the unthinkable. The horrendous, the horrible, and some things that I never thought I would hear myself say. We are going to be building with acacia wood. Not acacia wood logs, acacia wood planks in all their ugly orange glory. Uh, <laughs> so, as you take the path that leads from my dwarven base to the mesa, there's this lovely mountain right here, and I was thinking about it, and I thought, you know, it'd be really cool if there was a monastery at the top of this mountain. So we're going to build a small little monastery, and uh, I think it's going to be pretty cool. Now, there's a person on Reddit whose name is, I'm not sure if it's MC Noodler or Mick Noodler, but either way, uh, he is a Redditor, and he posted a collection of chunk-sized buildings quite a while back. I'll link it in the description if I remember. And one of those was an Asian monastery. And I'm taking a lot of inspiration for that. I'm not going to copy it exactly, but uh, I am taking a lot of inspiration from it. And I thought it'd be really cool to kind of do something with that. So the first thing I think we need to do is clear a little bit more space, just lower this a little bit so that we can see uh, the monastery. Because the whole idea is that as you're coming from the mesa along this pathway, you'll see the monastery up at the top of the mountain, uh, just kind of sitting there. It's not really going to serve any purpose other than just decorative um, aesthetics, but I think it'll be pretty cool once it's all said and done. So let me get a little bit more space cleared here, and I'll be back with you in just a second. All right, guys, I am back, and I've cleared some space. I think this will probably be enough. So the first thing I want to do is lay out a 12 by 12 area, and... I think we'll start about here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And we'll lay it out to about there. And then over here, we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So about here or so. And let's just clear some of this away so we know where our framework and our foundations are going to go. And we'll just use cobblestone to lay that out. There we go. Now these little spots here where it's kind of hanging over, I'm going to take cobblestone. I'm just going to bring those foundations up like that. And that will kind of form the base of our monastery here. Now let's come over here and lay down a couple of builder's chests just to put all this stuff in. And then I've got a bunch of acacia logs in here, which we're gonna need. Uh, I may need to go get more, but this will be a good start at least. And then let's grab some of this and... Oh, I don't actually have a crafting bench on me. That's kind of surprising. Okay, whatever. Let's just make one real quick. There we go. And then let's just make some stone bricks, like so. There we go. So I think these uh, little sections here, we're gonna build this up about three high, maybe four, but three at least. And then I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna mix in a decent amount of stone brick and maybe some smooth stone and stuff as well, just to kind of add some variation to this base. Uh, and I will be back with you as soon as that's done. All right, guys, I am back. So I've got that taken care of. Now the next thing we need to do is find the center of this. So one, two, three, four, five, right? Yep. So the center should be right about here. There we go. That looks good. And let's just put you back in here where you belong. Gather all of our blocks that are floating around. And I think that is pretty good. Now... We need, I really shouldn't have put that all the way over there. Uh, that's okay. So the next thing we need is we need some stairs. So let's grab eight. Yeah, that should be enough. And let's also grab some of our spruce as well. And we can get into our acacia then right away too. So we'll go like this, and we'll come over here, and we're going to put a staircase in right 
here that kind of leads up to the mountain or to the uh, the monastery. So that should be good. Uh, I do want to torch this up underneath here because we're going to have a floor above this, but I don't want a ton of monsters and things spawning underneath. That'll just look a little weird. So let's do this and let's quick knock these guys out. And let's just turn all of this into slabbage. I think that will be enough enough slabs, I hope. I guess we'll find out. So that'll go at our floor level right here. Which is not really going to be visible from down below. But it's going to make building a million times easier. Without this, it would be a nightmare. So. Let's do that. I'm trying to kind of be careful and not fall. There we go. Ah, that's a bug that they apparently fixed in the most recent snapshot, which I'm super excited about. That little, like, places on the bottom half in multiplayer, which has been one of the two bugs that drives me crazy, that one and uh, Ghost Blocks. So... Pretty happy, pretty stoked about that. All right, let's finish slabbing this up. Oh, there it goes again, whatever. You know what? Nobody's gonna see it anyway. It'll be our secret. And... Really? Come on now, stop doing that. There we go. All right, so we've got that in place. Now it's time to get into the acacia. So we're gonna go... One, two, three, four, and then one, two, three, one, two, three. Uh, let's bring that up one more. So we'll go five for that first level. And then one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Like that. So we're forming kind of a shape like this. And then here we'll go one, two, three, four and one two three four so we'll have kind of a front facade that looks sort of like this uh, i'm gonna go ahead and do that around the edges and then i'll come right back to you all right guys i am back so i've got that all taken care of now the next thing i think i need to do let's make a little way to get up here and then we're going to take spruce planks and bring them around here, like so. Just like this. And this is basically going to be our roof. Uh, that needs to disappear. And I think I had another one I messed up over here. Yeah, there we go. So we'll get rid of that as well. So that's kind of our basic roof. Now... We're going to need more spruce slabs, and then we're going to start needing some cobblestone slabs, and honestly, we're going to need quite a few of them, so let's make a bunch of those, and let's see if we can kind of finish this off. I also need to decide if I want to bring this out one more, and I'm kind of thinking I do, maybe. Yeah, I think I do want to bring this out one more. So let's bring these spruce planks. Oh, come on now. Can't seem to place blocks. Uh, over here. And this will be our first level. And then we'll have several other levels above this one. And the reason we're leaving these acacia... Uh, these as acacia blocks is just to kind of help us figure out where stuff goes and things like that. So it'll just make it a little easier. Oh, can I reach that? Yes, good. Okay, so we've got that going. Now it's time to put in the slabs. So we're gonna do the corners first. And for the corners, we're gonna go like this up at the top half of the block. And then we'll put one in here and break out the bottom one. And we'll do 
as I said, all of the corners first. There we go. Uh, I suppose we could potentially do it like that. Oh, that was silly of me. We could do it like that instead, and that'll give us a better chance of getting our slab back. Not that it really matters. I mean, cob cobblestone slabs aren't exactly a high-value item, let's be honest. Uh, and then we're going to come along the bottom here and put another row of cobblestone slabs like this along the bottom half of this block. And this will give us kind of a nice um, roof shape that kind of arcs up in that sort of uh, stereotypical traditional Asian style. There we go. And then one more side right here. And there we go. That should do it. Okay, so that looks pretty good. Let's head down and just see height-wise how it looks from down here. Pretty good, honestly. That's, that's pretty good. Oh, and it's got the waterfall flowing out right here. Oh, that's going to look amazing when it's all done. I totally forgot that the waterfall was even there. And then maybe we can do like a, a path of some sort that leads up. I think it'll be re I think this is this is going to be a very cool little project. Shouldn't take a ridiculous amount of time, but uh should be a pretty cool little project. So, okay, so we got that going. Now, we need to fill in this central portion right here with slabs, which may prove to be a bit of a nuisance. So let me get that done, and I'll be right back. All right, so that's taken care of. Now, what I want to do is count in one, two, three, and on the third block, I'm going to go one, two, three. One, two, three. Oh, just kidding. Three. And one, two, three. There we go. So then we'll have something sort of like this, and we're going to go and build these up four high as well. And there we go. So that looks good. And then I'm going to bring a line of spruce around the top like this and around the outside as well. There we go. Oh, falling. That's okay. Let's make some more spruce. Oh, oh, that's my staircase. <laughs> I, was, I was wondering what in the world that was. I was like, why am I falling right now? Okay, there we go. So that looks good. Now over here, you can kind of see the roof shape. We're going to basically replicate that same roof shape that we had uh, in the other part of the build, but we're going to do it over here instead. And I haven't decided yet how you're going to be able to get up to the top, if at all. Um, I may just... Uh, that staircase. Oh, well. We'll deal with that later. Uh, okay, so we'll get up there. And for now, let's just take some stone bricks and just pillar up. That's probably easier. And then slab. Slab. Slab, and slab, and then this one, I believe, yeah, that can be broken up. Okay, so that looks good. Now, we need to find our corners, which should be right here, and basically just do that exact same thing we just did a couple more times. All right, guys, I am back, and I've got a couple more levels done. I want to take a look at it from down below and see how it looks. Let's see... Let's just take a look from, like, right over here as you're coming along this path. Ooh. <laughs> that is not bad. 
That is not bad at all. I like it. I think it's definitely coming along. Um, do I want to give it one more level? I think I do. I think I want one more level here, and then we'll cap it off with a big, tall, kind of cone-shaped tower. Go away, zombie. Like, seriously, go away. Do I, have, I do have smite on my axe. Note to self. Kill zombies with, with axe instead of sword. Uh, anyway, so I have another level to do, and then we'll put the top on it. All right, guys, so we've got our, uh, our additional level on here. So now it's time to work on the roof a bit. So let's put a flat surface up here for us to kind of build with and work with. Uh, my pillar's down there, so I'm just going to leave a gap right here so that I know that. And then we need to build this out so that it matches uh, size-wise with all the other ones. Uh, I need more spruce. And let's go out like this. And like so. There we go. Okay, now, along this edge, we're going to do the same thing on the outer edge that we did down below with the, uh, the changing little thingies. <laughs> I don't know what to call them. The inverted, uh, I don't know, whatever these things are called. This little bit right here where it kind of goes up in the corners. I don't know what the technical term for that is. Uh... But we'll do that along the sides over here. And then down, uh, and then we're going to actually start working on the interior portion. So here, we'll go like this. And we'll bring it up. Hmm. Maybe three? Or maybe four again, honestly. Yeah, I think we'll go four again. But then... We're gonna need some spruce... Stairs. That's not what I want. We're gonna need some spruce stairs. You go here. Spruce stairs, please. Thank you. And we'll put a row of those around here like this. Then we will come... Let's actually put a torch down there, just to keep that lit up. Then we're going to go up again. Oop. Like this and we'll go let's see so that's too higher right yep yes yes so here we'll go up I think three and add our little spruce roof here and then last but not least, right here we'll go four again. Like this. Add one row of planks. And then here, 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 and there. And that should cap it all off, I think. So, now let's take a look and just see how that looks from over here. That's not bad. In fact, that's actually pretty good. That's very, very similar to what I was going for. And I think that actually works really nicely.
I like it. I like it quite a lot. I mean, we've got this gray pillar going up the middle, which needs to go away because that's where I was. Uh, that was just my builder's scaffolding, basically. So that needs to disappear. But that's easily remedied. Here we go. And let's just come on inside. We'll have to fix up a lot of this. And obviously there's a lot of detail work that needs to be added and things like that. But all in all... It's not bad. Uh, and I need one plank there. That should do. And then let's see. I think in these corners on each level, we're going to put some torches down. Because that'll keep everything kind of lit up. And from down below, it should actually look pretty cool. We're not really going to do... As I said... This building really is just going to be for aesthetic purposes from down below, so we're not really going to do like an interior here or anything like that. Uh, but we do want it to look cool from down below, especially at night, so uh, that's all good. And then I think the last thing that I want to do in this episode, because we're going to finish this project up in the next one, uh, we'll do a lot of the detail work and stuff like that next time. Uh, but in this episode, I think I want to make... Uh, I gotta remember what the recipe is. Is it that? Yeah, there we go. I want to make a whole bunch of oak fences. Let's do that. And just make a ton of them. Um, hopefully that will be enough for now. I think that'll probably be enough total, honestly, but we'll see. Uh, and it is getting late, so let's sleep super quick. And then as far as the fences go, we're going to put those where they belong. And I'll show you where that is in a second, as soon as the sun comes up. Good morning. Okay, so we'll take our oak fences, and basically we're just going to put those right along this edge. Like so. And wrapping all the way around. Just like that. Uh, we may put some torches on there. Maybe, maybe not. Haven't decided yet. But, oh, that's a terrible. Let's not use that corner. Let's use this corner. There we go. And then we're going to do basically the same on all of these towers. So here's where I need to get back out. So let's just kind of work our way around over here like so there we go and then pillar up until we reach the next level rinse dry repeat so let me get this done and i'll be back with you all right guys i am back and i put all the fences in i did decide that i wanted to add a little bit of cobble to this upper level up here uh, because it was looking, it just wouldn't, it just didn't look very good. So we're going to add a little bit of that, just kind of right in here. And we'll add it, ooh, this one could be a little bit trickier. Although we could do, well, no, that really wouldn't work either. Yeah, yeah, it would. We can do that. Um, getting up there's a little bit of an issue, though. Let's see. Can I, like, boop? Look at that. Absolutely fantastic. Okay, so that's all good. And we'll add this little guy down here. And like so, that's all good there. This one I still need to do. So let's get up here. Did I start on this yet? No, I didn't. That's fine. So, same kind of a deal here. Oh. 
Oh, I see. Okay. So in that case, let's swing up here. I forgot that this is actually the bottom half of a block right here. Why did I do that? That was not intentional. There we go. We'll go like that. And then these guys are actually supposed to be down here. Like so. Because this would be where it comes up. Over. Here it's down. Here it's down again. Up. That level. Uh, here and then down. Okay. And then we just gotta deal with these ones. And then, I think structurally, oh, why is that one all derped up? I don't know, but we'll fix it. There we go. There, I think structurally now we should be good. Let's take one more look at it from down below and see what we think. Um... It's good, except for that very top one. I think that needs to go away. Other than that, it looks great. Let me get that change made. All right, and there we go. That actually looks pretty good. So guys, that is going to do it for this episode. We got a monastery built. Next episode, we'll probably have to go in and do all the detailing to it, because it's not done yet. Still some work to do. But I am out of time. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. I do appreciate it. And it really helps out my channel. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch. There are links in the video description below. So check that out as well. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching. And I'll definitely see you next time.